If anybody finds James's shoes, um, he lost them in 1987. There it is. He survived KFC. There you go. Take it out. I was like, something's weird. <laughs> Just not right. Uh, there, there's a pick on my um, seat there, James. Just, um, yeah, please don't lose it. Put it back where you found it. Good man. Okay, um, guys and girls, this is James Kangaroo. He's, he comes down here every week to perform for us. He's a great guy. Um, just uh, be aware of his reptilian antics and you won't go too far wrong. Um, <laughs> please make you feel welcome, everybody. A bit of clapping and cheering. Thank you. Thank you. There he is, James Kangaroo. Okay. Like Eric said. Okay. Uh, any requests? Flies. Flies. <laughs> Yeah, I think well, to well, well, well. Toilet in a Tree. Do you want yeah, to okay. I think Toilet in the Tree was sounded a bit louder. All right, I'll do that one. But I've got to tell you something. Yeah, I haven't done that. Yeah, okay. No, I'll do Toilet Up a Tree. Yeah. Okay, um, this song is about a toilet. Okay, so where I come from, there's a bit of a story behind it. Somebody hung a toilet up a tree. Yeah, it's true, and the fire brigade had to take it down. It was very, very, very funny, and it made the newspaper, and this is the story about the toilet up a tree. Let me tell you a story about a toilet bowl. It used to be owned by a guy whose name was Noel. He threw this toilet out near the old chook pen. This poor old toilet bowl thought it would never be used again. Along came a boy to rescue this poor loo and give it a reward for taking so much poo. He took this toilet bowl and hung it from a tree just right near the highway so everyone could see. So what could they see? It was a toilet stuck in a tree. A what? A toilet stuck in a tree. Are you serious? Believe it or not, that's what we have got. A toilet stuck in a tree. It was giving laughter out to everyone Since this blue was made, it's the best thing it has done It was just hanging there, not knowing what to do And everybody driving by had a perfect view Along came a truck driver, he was quite surprised When he saw the toilet hang there, he couldn't believe his eyes He got the walkie-talkie in a bit of shock And called up his mate to tell him what we've got So what do we got? It was a toilet stuck in a tree Yeah! A toilet stuck in a tree No way! Far from the ground, hanging around A toilet stuck in a tree Along came a man to spoil all the fun He called up the fire brigade What a stupid car, Killjoy He said there's a toilet hanging from a tree Captain Darrell Bird said Are you kidding me? He called up his troops and they were well prepared One of them was Ken and Kenny wasn't scared He climbed up a ladder and got the dunny down Now this blue is back safely on the ground It was a toilet stuck in a tree Yeah, a toilet stuck in a tree No way, far from the ground Hanging around, a toilet stuck in a tree there was one more surprise for Daryl Burns crew They looked into the toilet bowl and saw a fat cow poo They thought it was so funny and laughed themselves to bits And the boy who hung the dunny, he really got the shits It was, did I already do this first? Now I'll kill it again. It was in the paper. This story is all true. The firemen were heroes for rescuing a loo. Some may think their time was wasted as a whole. At least they are rewarded with a toilet bowl. La, la, everybody la, la. It was a toilet stuck in a tree. Oh yeah. 
A toilet stuck in a tree That's right, far from the ground Hanging around A toilet stuck in a tree It was a toilet stuck in a tree A what? A toilet stuck in a tree Are you serious? Believe it or not That's what we have got A toilet stuck in a tree Well there is a moral to this story everybody Do you want to hear it? If you're bored at home and you've not got much to do, you really should then try out hanging up a loo. Even hang a sink and maybe hang a bath because it gives yourself and everyone a laugh. Thank you.